Hi guys, I'm Tori Sterling. Welcome back to my channel. So I just got the new Moonlight by Ariana Grande perfume and I am loving it. So this video is sponsored by Moonlight, but as always, I only work with brands that I absolutely adore and like how cool is it that I'm literally working with Ariana Grande's perfume? Like Ariana Grande. Come on, like... This is so exciting. But because Ariana Grande is literally my woman crush Wednesday and because she always looks so confident and so fierce, I think her perfume really captures that smell of confidence and being fierce and feminine. So I really wanted to create a look inspired by that. So this is a look that I pretty much feel my most confident in. It's a lot of my go-to looks and I know that whenever I'm in a pinch and I want to look good and feel good about myself, this is a look that I can go to and I know no matter what that I'm going to feel pretty in it. I'm going to feel confident in it and that's exactly how makeup should make you feel. Now that I have the Moonlight Perfume by Ariana Grande to go along with it, I can look great and smell great for the holidays. Like, does it get any better? Let me know. If you guys are new to my channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button. I upload videos as often as I can. And if you guys are part of my styling fam hello welcome back and miss you guys so much so enough babbling let's just get on to the makeup tutorial so before you guys start on the makeup look I want to show you guys the moonlight by Ariana Grande perfume for inspiration so that we're all on the same page here I've already been using this but I kept the box because I wanted to show you guys how cute it was because it's really cute I don't know I just like it this is the bottle look how cute it is it's like iridescent it like literally shines like moonlight like it's so freaking cool and the puff can we just take a minute for how cute this puff is Mm, this one literally smells so good. So the best way that I can explain it is that it opens up with like black currant and plum. But then you peel it back a layer and it lightens up to marshmallow and vanilla. And it has this little hint of sandalwood just to finish it off, which just makes it really feminine and super flirty. But enough of this, let's uh, get started with the makeup. So because Moonlight is very alluring and luminous, that's the kind of the makeup look that I'm gonna go for, a very light, luminous look that'll highlight the key points of my face, but also makes me feel my best and my most confident, which is how I think all of your makeup should make you feel. And because it's also pretty feminine and flirty, I wanna make sure that I feel pretty in my makeup, and in return, that makes me feel confident in my makeup. So the first thing that I'm gonna do is apply some foundation. This is just my favorite luminous foundation. You can use any foundation that you know works best for your skin tone. And I'm actually mixing in and a drop of beauty oil so that I can get a little more luminosity to my look. And I'm just blending this all in with a stippling brush. I'm gonna dab just a little tiny bit of concealer underneath my eyes. I'm keeping this as minimal as I can just to keep it nice and light and fun. But then I'm also gonna throw a little bit of highlighter. Yes, I know I'm going V minimal today. I'm throwing a little bit of highlighter right here on my cheekbones just to keep everything as uplifted as I can. I always like blending my highlight with my concealer just so that they kind of get, I don't know, they sort of just flow together into one. And then blend that all out. Then with my fave setting powder, I'm just gonna go in and set underneath the under eyes. And anywhere that I put concealer, I'm gonna take a shimmery bronzer. I'm doing a very light tapping motion here so that I'm not like over drowning the luminosity of the highlight because I do wanna keep it pretty light and pretty airy, but you can kind of see the difference that the bronzer makes on this side of my face versus this side. It just makes it look a little bit more sun-kissed, a little bit more put together, a little more flirty, a little more feminine, a little more fun. And for highlight, I'm just gonna accentuate this highlight a little bit more with a golden highlighter right here just on the highest points of my cheekbones to lift everything up. To keep this look super simple and V monochromatic, what I like to do is take my bronzer that I use and I just like to throw this right over top of my lid right here onto my eyes just so that everything sort of ties in together and it's like one color scheme going on and it just looks very coordinated and like you spent a lot of time on your makeup. And then I'm also just going to run this color right here along my lower lashes because we're eventually going to go back and play up with some eyeliner, which I love doing. And I just like playing with the shape of my eyes. But for right now, I'm just playing this up right here. And then with my highlight that I just took, I'm going to take that on my highlight, my little eye highlight brush. And this is going to go right underneath my brows, which I'm going to fill in in a hot sec, so don't worry. And then I'm also going to throw it on my inner corner right here. So because this perfume does have like a black currant plum vibe feel going on, I definitely want to capture that dark essence into my makeup. And I love always playing with my eyes. Like I said before, I love it when my eyes have like a little bit of black in them or something just to play up the blue in my eyes to make them a little more blue, make me feel a little more flirty, a little more feminine. So what I'm going to do is take a black eyeliner and I'm just going to rim my waterline of both eyes right here 
focusing it mostly on this outer corner, but I do bring it all the way in. Then I'm just gonna smudge a little tiny bit on the outer corner of my lower lash line. And then I'm also just gonna lightly rim the outer corner of my upper lash line. See, it's very light. Don't worry, we go back in and we make it, we make it worth something, we smudge it out. Then I'm gonna go in right here with the smudger brush and just smudge this out and smudge it out on my lower lash line as well. Mmm, see how that just plays up your eye? Now onto mascara. I love a lot of mascara, so this is a part that I really play up with a lot of mascara. First, you gotta curl your eyelashes and then just pile on some mascara. Then I'm just gonna finish off the look with a little bit of lips, and I always feel the best in nudes with glossy lips. You will literally never see me in anything except nude lips and glossy lips. That is my wave. And then just some pink lip gloss. So here's the completed look. It's like a dewy, luminous look that highlights my best features, but can work for anyone. And of course, the final touch is to add a spritz of moonlight by Ariana Grande, the star of the show. So now I look and I feel confident just like Ariana. And I think this perfume is really awesome because Moonlight by Ariana Grande was created to celebrate your uniqueness and be bold and be confident and just be you. I mean, also to smell amazing, <laughs> but the message behind it is really important and something that I fully stand behind. I want you guys to show me your Moonlight inspired looks or whatever looks makes you feel most confident and prettiest and best in your own skin. Also, if you guys want Moonlight for yourself, I'll have the link down below, but it's also available in all Ulta stores, so go head on over, check it out, give it a smell for yourself. It is amazing. You will absolutely love it. But I hope you guys all enjoy this video thank you guys so much for watching um i really hope you did enjoy it if you did be sure to give me a thumbs up and leave a comment down below of any other videos you guys want to see from me in the future and i hope you guys have a fantastic day i'll talk to you guys in my next video bye